Hey everyone, it's Ryan. Thanks for watching the video. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. So today's video, I'm going to be talking about my 100 day fitness challenge. That's right, 100 days of fitness challenge. So yesterday I was laying in bed and I was just like, you know what? I really want to make a change. I've said I've been making, wanting to make a change for such a long time and I never get around to it. So I put together a little program that I'm doing. I've already done today's part of it and every day for the next 100 days it will get more and more intense over the time period. So I have it on my phone and I'll read it off for you guys so you can know exactly what to do. So. The one thing I really wanted to do is I wanted to make the fitness challenge, I wanted to make it different, I wanted to make it bigger every time. So, for the first five, first day to five days, you'll be doing 30 push-ups and 15 sit-ups. So that is 10 push-ups, then 5 sit-ups, and you keep repeating yourself three times. Following that, you'll be doing a 60 second plank, and you'll be doing a jog of one kilometers. So that's what you're going to be doing for the first five days. For days six to eleven, you'll be doing 45 push-ups and 30 sit-ups. So that's 15 push-ups and then 10 sit-ups, and you repeat that three times, followed by a plank for 90 seconds. That's one and a half minutes, and then a jog for one and a half kilometers. So you can see it's already starting to rise up and build. As time, your body's going to be more comfortable with it, you're going to be able to adjust to it. You'll be a lot more comfortable with what you're doing. Days 12 to 17, you'll be doing 60 push-ups and 45 sit-ups. So you'll be doing 3 sets, still 3 sets, 20 push-ups, 15 sit-ups. So it's increased. You'll be planking for 120 seconds. That's a long time. That's 2 minutes. 2 minutes of planking after doing all that. It's a very intense workout. You'll be jogging for two kilometers. Now, I understand if you can't do the whole plank right away, you can't do all of two minutes, that's okay. As long as you do that two minute plank that day, that's fine. So if you can only do 30 seconds, and then wait another 30 seconds, and then keep doing it in seconds, that's fine, as long as you're getting it done. Days 18 to 22, 75 push-ups and 60 sit-ups. So, 25 push-ups, 20 sit-ups, you repeat that. Planking for 150 seconds. So, two and a half minutes, and you'll be jogging for two kilometers. So, the jogging part doesn't change. Days 23 to 27, you'll be doing 90 push-ups and 75 sit-ups. So, that's 30 push-ups followed by 25 sit-ups, and you repeat that two or three more times. You plank for 120 seconds, so it's less than what you did last week. But you're jogging more for two and a half kilometers. Days 28 to 30, you'll do 90 push-ups and 75 sit-ups. So that's 30 push-ups and then 25 sit-ups, and you repeat that. And you're going to be planking for 150 seconds, which is two and a half minutes, and you'll be jogging for three kilometers. So this will be your longest distance that you've done jogging so far. So that was just the initial 30 days. You're building up all that stamina. You're building up so you're able to uh, have the energy. So the next days, it's a, little, a lot more spread out. So days 31 to 50, you'll be doing 120 push-ups and 120 sit-ups. So that's four sets of each. You'll be planking for 120 seconds, two minutes. You'll be jogging for three kilometers. That's what it is. Days 51 to 70, you'll be doing 150 push ups, 150 sit ups. That's five sets of 30 push ups and five sets of 30 sit ups. You'll be planking for 120 seconds, two minutes, and you'll be jogging for three and a half kilometers. Now, the final stretch is days 71 to 100. This is going to be the most intense part of this workout but it's going to show off your results the best. So, you'll be doing 6 sets of 30 push-ups. That's 180 push-ups. 6 sets of 30 sit-ups, that's 180 sit-ups. You'll be planking for 120 seconds, which is 2 minutes. 
and you'll be jogging for four kilometers. That'll be your longest distance. So those days will be your most brutal workout, but at the end of that 100 days, you'll have the results to show it. Today was my day one. I've done everything. I just need to do my one kilometer jog. So I'm already good to go for day one, and I'm looking forward to this, and I will be doing a lot of fitness tracking. And uh, right now, I weighed myself this morning. I wasn't too impressed with the scale. I think it must be lying or something. I haven't seen that kind of number, but... This is how I am right now. I have a little bit of body fat. So what you can see. So I will be working on getting this, slimming it down. Uh, with this fitness challenge, I hope I can drop at least 20 pounds for 100 days. That brings it to about March, mid-March. So that's like uh, December, January, February. Three and a half months to lose about 20 pounds. I think it's doable. So we'll keep up the keep up with the uh, routine. We'll see what happens, and I'll uh, share my success along the way. And hopefully, you'll do the same. Uh, try it out. I will post in the description. I will show the workout and all the steps. I'll have it all outlined for you, make it easier for you. So stay tuned. Thanks for watching, and enjoy your day. Bye.